Hey, what's up guys? Hayden Hunt here, back with another video, and today I'll be talking about Michael Jackson sunglasses. This is going to be a long video, so to speak, but this is inspiration from the Everything About Michael Jackson shoes. Link will be down in the description for that video, and this you know what? I'm going to make a series. Everything about Michael Jackson, insert blank here. So we've got the first episode, everything about Michael Jackson loafers. Now we're doing everything about Michael Jackson sunglasses. We've got a lot of pair of sunglasses here. Michael Jackson used five, but at the moment I've currently got four sunglasses in my hand. One I used to have, but then I lost it. I'm going to cover all the eras. I'm going to cover all the models. And um, yeah, links will be down in the description below on where to buy them. This is a sponsored video per se, thanks to our mates at Triton Store. They specialize in Michael Jackson clothing as well as other knickknacks and all that stuff. You can find all these sunglasses and many more in the links in the description below. I'm happy to be an ambassador and proud buyer of these products that Triton Store offers. And yeah, I'm sure that you'll like them too. I've been talking to them, been emailing, clicking forward and part of their ambassador program. So let's get into the video. Let's just start off with any random sunglasses, so to speak. But before we continue the video, I'd like to talk about my business called Hayden Horn Media. For those of you who don't know, Hayden Horn Media is a freelancing video production service. Links will be in the description below retained to our business. We do freelancing videos for any event, big or small, whether it be your birthday party, your event. You can check us out on the following social media links at instagram.com slash Hayden Horn Media, facebook.com slash Hayden Horn Media, or you can subscribe to our new business YouTube channel called once again, Hayden Horn Media. There on each social media link, you get to see what I actually do on a professional basis, which is basically on set with a camera, doing sound, or all other cool things revolving around the film industry. So if you're a main fan of the Hayden Horn channel and you want to support us even more, feel free to subscribe to the Hayden Horn Media channel and don't forget to follow on our other social media links. And don't forget to check out our new custom website, HaydenHornMedia.com. How simple is that? There you get to see all the works that I've done underneath the Hayden Horn Media label, the services we offer, and basically you can check out the services that we have to offer. Now, let's get back into the main video. So let's start off with the classic aviators. I've got two aviators in my hands and Michael Jackson wore these aviators. Whoops, I don't know why the hinge popped out. Michael Jackson wore these sunglasses. This is synonymous with him. If you see any pictures with him from every different era, these are synonymous with him. He wore different types of aviators, but usually it's the traditional face shaped ones that people see him most regularly. Let's start off with these sunglasses. So basically from these sunglasses onwards, I'm going to show them in my hand and then I'm going to show them what does it look like on my face. So this is what the first sunglasses look like. These ones are quite oversized and these remind me of like the Victory Tour glasses and also the Dangerous World Tour sunglasses that he wore. This is Triton's own brand of sunglasses. These aren't Ray-Bans that MJ wore, but these are probably the closest you can actually get to the, one of the Victory Tour glasses. MJ wore a variety of sunglasses in terms of the color, but usually black is the best way to go because it actually matches with probably almost all of his outfits as well as you can wear them on a casual basis. Let's chuck these on. So this is what the sunglasses look like on my face. It's kind of weird that I'm in a studio and I'm wearing sunglasses with these blaring lights but these are what it looks like. It covers the eyebrows and mainly covers the face. It feels like wearing goggles. However, this is good for sun protection as well as doing that iconic moment in the Dangerous Tour where he's just standing there like this. Crowd's going wild. Reaches in, takes them off. One, two, three. Yeah, etc., etc. So, this is what one of the models that he has worn. The second one is these aviators. So at first glance, these aviators look like the same, but if you zoom in on them, they look very different. So the main difference is, is the size as well as the type of lens. Let's look into this. So this brand is called Moai Gym, but aptly known as MJ. It's very appropriate. And these are the first sunglasses I actually ever got of the aviator style. Now, as you can see that the shape is actually quite small and this is more of a horizontal kind of thing. And basically the lens, they're polarized as well as they're mirrored. So the last glasses that we saw, that was dark and more so, yeah, probably not mirrored. That's lack of better words. But if you were to put these on, which I'm gonna do now, you can see a difference. 
And yeah, I'm not sure you can see it, but I've zoomed it in and on the side, it's laser etched saying more gyms. But I like to think it says Michael Jackson on it. Let's chuck this on. So these are what these glasses look like. Obviously they're not oversized lenses, so you can actually see my eyebrows. I think that this is probably the most appropriate shape for my face. These look like basic ABAs that you see all around the place. And yeah, I don't know what to say about these. These look like good generic aviators. These sunglasses remind me of what he wore through like the 90s and the early 2000s, so to speak. All right, let's go on with the next sunglasses. Now, these glasses, these are probably a much more rarer sight of MJ wearing. These are called the Club Masters. This is from Ray-Ban, but also Triton sells their own models in the links in the description below. Now, these are pretty cool glasses. You probably see them, these are much more modern style. However, this is what it looks like. We'll probably zoom in as well. And the lens, although it looks like it's black at the front, it's actually a dark green tint. So the piping on these glasses is actually black and gold, which is an awesome aesthetic. It reminds me of the next glasses I'm gonna be talking about, which is called the Wayfarers. But we're gonna talk about these club masters first. This is what the front looks like. These are probably the most like modern glasses that probably you've seen on the street and all that stuff. Let's check it on my face. So this is what the Clubmaster looks like on my face. The only instance that I saw MJ wearing it was back in 1992 or 1993 where it's, it's literally this picture where someone's showing him a magic trick and he's sitting down with these sunglasses on. Let's get on with the next glasses called the Wayfarers. Now I don't own a model of the Wayfarer glasses but I can talk to you about them. Now the Wayfarers is a popular 80s model from Ray-Ban and MJ wore them throughout the bad tour. You can see in this picture and in this picture, you've seen this style everywhere but you just didn't know what the name was. If you did, congratulations. This is what MJ wore during the 80s. And last but not least, these are the awesome glasses that I've recently caught. These are from Carrera, actually. This is the brand that MJ wore used during the Victory Tour. And he also used a similar style pair called Ray-Ban Wings 2, which is rare to find. However, Triton does sell them. I'm gonna buy them, I'm gonna review them. But yeah, all these sunglasses, despite the Moai Gym Aviators, you can buy them online in the links in the description below. So these are probably the most awesome glasses I've ever seen in my life. Let's get into it. So yeah, these are very reminiscent of the MJ early 80s aviator, also navigator style glasses that he wore during the Victory Tour. What I've got is a blue tinge from Carrera. It's popular in black, brown, gold, silver, you name all the metal colors and they have it. This is what it looks like. So it's a bluish kind of tint as well as gold piping on the side. Let's chuck these on. So these are what the Carrera Navigator sunglasses look like on my face. What I feel that this is a combination between the both Aviator sunglasses I've shown you in the previous lot, as well as the Ray-Ban wings. This is probably the best MJ Victory Tour glasses that you could probably find. And I'm very happy to put the links in the description below. I don't think no one has done a comprehensive video like this. And if so, good on them. I'm probably just regurgitating the same information. But yeah, having a sunglasses video is underrated. So yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoy it. Like and subscribe. Check out the links in the description below. I think like that one's gonna fall any minute. And I can't really breathe because this is pressing on my nose. Hope you enjoyed, like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Catch around. I'm dead inside.